All right, I made this purchase here yesterday. Um, got that remote stand location, so I wanted a camera that I don't have to go back into all the time and, and uh, kind of see what's back there and not have to mess with this area any more than I have to. It's a, it's a long hike to get back in there and I don't want to mess this area up. So bought this uh, yesterday at Field of Stream here in North Charleston. It's a MCG 13478 model. It's a XV6000. Um, so got it set up last night. It really wasn't that difficult. Um, it takes a lot of batteries. The first thing I did is went and got a 12-volt uh, battery from Tractor Supply. And uh, I'll rig up something here to hook into that so I don't have to mess with these batteries. But, uh, this is really the only controls on the whole thing. Everything is done through the app on your iPhone. Uh, just stick the, get the SD card, stick it in there, and um, <clears throat> load the app onto your phone, go in there, activate an account, you just uh, scan this barcode. It sets it all up for you, and uh, you pick a plan. Plans are it's, stuff's not cheap. You know, it's um, I think cheapest one was nineteen ninety nine a month, and that was for maybe I can't remember what it was. Maybe a thousand pictures a month. The next one up was three thousand, and it went to six thousand, and uh, I think I ended up doing the three thousand. So I don't know really what to expect with this thing, but uh, the setup was very, very easy. Um, it all, does it all automatically. Um, you get the, the card put in there, get the thing signed up. Um, you hit that, hold that down, I think five seconds. Everything will start to flash. And uh, it'll take a test picture and send it to the cloud and you get a notification on your phone. And uh, open it up and, and there's the picture. So it, was, uh, it worked really well. So the good thing is this hunting camp is in an area that really does have pretty good cell reception. Uh, there's two modes that you can buy this thing with. Uh, one is a box that has the uh, Verizon, and the other one is AT&T. So I got the one with Verizon since it seems to work better. Um, there's some good places here to put a cable through and lock this thing to the tree. This was only uh, $119. Um, but again, you know, I'm paying uh, 29 a month for the cell cellular plan. So, you know, it's not cheap, but you know, this set of batteries, I think 12 batteries, cost me around 11, you know, it was about, I think $11. That's, you know, that's not the best battery. Um, so a buck a battery, you know, $12, you probably, Depending on what kind of use this thing takes, you know, you could go through that in a month. So it's, uh, I think it'll be okay. But anyway, I got the, the 12 volt to go in there. I just got to rig and find a plug to fit that, and then rig up some alligator clips. But pretty simple instructions on the inside. So they only recommended, I think, uh, an eight gig card. I've got a 16 in there, and it seems to work fine. The, um, I think got four, I had to format the card, and that's real simple. That's got its own button here to format the card. So you put the, put the chip in there and hold that down a few seconds, and, and uh, it'll start to flash yellow. And it'll format the card for you. But, uh, this looks pretty cool, you know. It'll give you uh, all this diagnostic stuff here is all on the uh, on the web app, so you can see all this remotely. You know what your battery is, your signal is, how full your card is. Um, so looking forward to this. I'm just going out in the swamp there, so I don't have to mess around with it too much. Pretty, uh, I'm pretty pleased with it. It's heavy with all the batteries in it, but it just this thing here locks the whole thing down. And I'll get a good cable through this and get it secured to the tree. I don't think anyone will mess with it, but still it's a lot of money. So picture looked fairly good. I think you can, uh, that 3,000 
photos a month as uh, I think if you, it gives you thumbnails, that's 3,000 thumbnails. If you want the high resolution, then you click a little button that says high res. That counts for 35 pictures of your, however many you've allotted for the month. So that's one thing that they don't really tell you about. But if you want the good, you know, 10 or 12 megapixel photograph or whatever it is you're looking at, then uh, it'll cost you 35 photos of your purchased allotment. But uh, it looks pretty good. I mean, the color's great. I think it'll, it'll disappear on the tree. So, trying to get it out. We got a tropical storm coming in today off the uh, coast of South Carolina. I don't know if I'll be able to get out. My plan was to go up tonight and do that, but uh, we'll have to see. If it dries out, it's supposed to be out of here about noon. So, I'll do some video when I take it back in there.